So you want to port a 1.6 map into CS2. Well, this tutorial is for you then. First, open up WinBSPC, File, Convert, and select the VSP file from your map. Select the folder in which you want to extract it, and tickle map. As for these three boxes, I don't really care because I didn't find them useful at all. Hit OK. Now you're going to open Jackhammer, go into File, Open, and you open up that map file selecting Half-Life Map. Go into File, Save As, make sure you're saving as a BMF. Close it. Now you're going to launch Counter-Strike 2 tools, and you're going to create a new add-on. Give it whatever name you want, in my case, Text16 will do. Open it, and you're going to move your BMF into the folder of this add-on. On the Asset Browser, launch Hammer, File, Open, Source 1 Maps, BMF, open it up. Go into 2D View Mode, select everything, back into Fulbright, Shift-T to apply a depth texture, and there it is your map now. Just texture the map with new materials from Source 2. Now, most of the entities are broken, are obsolete, so you're gonna have to replace them. Go into this page, so item 4, this corresponds to an AK-47. Now with the player starts, it's the same thing. Info player start is actually info player terrorist. And do the same thing for the CT entities, that are also obsolete. Add an MB sky to your map. And we no longer need a skybox, so you can completely delete all of the roof. Now in 1.6, we used to use brushes. Now we are using meshes, which are much more effective. So you will want to replace all of these cubes with either props or creative rooms. In the case of the floor, I'm going to be using a displacement. So I will recreate everything using meshes. Then I will add many props to make it look as beautiful as possible. And of course, lots of overlays as graffitis. And there you go, a fancy, beautiful looking map. Pretty nice, huh? Hope you guys enjoyed. Take care.